All right, today I got a really quick tip about CSS specificity. If you're working in client first and you're putting padding top and then a combo class of padding large, I actually added this client first project after the fact, which is why I'm having this problem. And I'm getting three rim all around when I expect just to get three rim on the top and these to be zero. The reason you're having this problem is CSS specificity. The way to fix it is to download the FinSuite Chrome plugin, go to candies here, and then go down to CSS Styles Reorder. They have a great link to an article about CSS specificity. Uh, so you can read all about it here. I'm not going to get into the details, but some cool notes here. Uh, inline styles always get a value of 1,000, so it gets highest priority. And then if you write custom CSS, you can add this um, exclamation point important to override that. We're not going to do that. We're going to go into the styles reorder here. And I'm just going to hit Control F, and I'm going to search for padding large. And you see I have padding large here behind or under padding top. What I want to do is just drag that up here, and then I'm going to save. I'm ready. It's going to reload my project. And now, if I look at this padding top with padding large, it's behaving as I would expect it. Got all zeros here. So that's the tip. Check you later.